way of thinking. It's the world. You go to Israel, the blacks are just treated like dogs. So do you have the, to treat them like that too? The white Jews, there's white Jews or black Jews. Do you understand? And are the black Jews less than the white Jews? 100%, 50, 100 And is that right? It is a question. We don't evaluate what's right and wrong. We live in a society. We live in a culture. We have to live with that culture. And I got more examples. No matter how many menorah lamps you have, you'll never hold a candle to the levels of pressure I was born to handle. You know why? Because you don't have no souls or backbones. Bro, you don't even know your past, bro. Real Jews were Hebrews, black men who used to grow their afros. You Hebrews, black men who used to grow their afros. You guys are just a bunch of fucking random, phony, phony Polish assholes who forged your passports and don't have a land of your own, so you come over and jack yours. But what is it all for? Is it drilling offshore? Is it the land, or do you want more? See, Arabs, we're peaceful, bro. You could come into my house. The average woman is not in nutrition from far the day she came in the gym. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she was so fine. What was it like marrying a black lady? You white? Well, you and we're the original black people. <laughs> Do you know that the black man in America is Israel? That he's Jews? Do you know that? Yes, 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 yes. What I'm about to tell you is that the Israelites, the so-called Jews that are living in Israel today, are not the real Israelites. The real Israelites are the black and brown people of the world. The true Jews, according to the Bible, you can check it in the Bible, you can read the Job 30, 30 and some other places. They have never been white. They have been people of color. And they have not stopped in Ethiopia. They were in West, in Ethiopia, Sudan, and they have settled in West Africa. From West Africa, they have been taken as a slaves to America. Brothers and sisters, blacks of America, it's you. You are the true Hebrews. We question everything we know about Christianity. Starring Flo Rida. That's rapper Flo Rida in New York. And holy crap, check out that thing around his neck. It's a scarf. Oh, this other thing around his neck is huge too. Flo Rida, wearing the biggest necklace I think I've ever seen. It's a big gold Jesus. This thing must cost like a couple million bucks. And it doesn't even come with a body. I love that thing, that thing's epic. But what's with the, what's with the white deep Jesus? You got a problem with Caucasian Christ? No, there should be a black Jesus one. Why would there be a black Jesus? Jesus is black. Jesus is black. Yeah, if Jesus is black, how come he's white in all the paintings? Because they didn't want to teach the peasants how to read when the Catholic Church was ripping them off. And they realized they were being scammed, so they just painted pictures of white people they could relate to. Learned that in art history class. And he was wrongly convicted! Of course he's black! This changes everything! So, so Conversion. Personally, I like to think that the same people who think Chuck Norris is a great actor think Obama's the Antichrist. That's hilarious to me. But keep in mind, according to the book of Revelation, John saw Jesus and described him as having hair like wool and feet the color of burned brass. Yeah, he's a brother. It's going to be very awkward for the rapture of folk when Jesus comes back and winds up being a homeless liberal black guy who speaks zero English. Now, I know this is very depressing, all you rapture Christians, but cheer up. The rapture may be a racket, but it's not the end of the world. Real Jews, Israelites, or Hebrew Israelites have a black skin complexion and uh, hair like wool. Um, you so called Africa, Afro, uh, Afro Americans, or Africans, or Blacks, or Negro, must wake up. You are the real Israel who suffered the slavery and scattered on the earth through slavery. Read uh, Deuteronomy chapter 28. Uh, you are from tribe of Judah by blood. I'm just a minister for the Lord, and uh, these are. These are the actual Israelites, ancient Israelites. Uh -huh. Depicted in Egypt, uh, two walls. These are uh, the Syrian captives. I believe these are probably Levite priests because the hair is cut a certain length. Uh, they also have their hair 
Jews. Well, and Israelites are those people that were taken uh, into slavery through Atlantic slave trade and scattered through all nations of the world. Hi, Shalom, Shalom from Israel. This is Ola, the daughter of Jethro. And I just heard that you black people that was stolen from Africa to America, that you don't know who you are. But you are the children of, of Yahweh, the children of Israel. I would interject that the true biblical Hebrews are the so-called African-American people that are scattered abroad throughout the world. Shalom, you two. I uh, felt compelled to make this video, for lack of a better term, and I'm going to entitle it, I am sick of white people. And yes, I'm white. And the reason I'm sick of white people is because no matter how much fact, no matter how much scripture you all are presented with regarding who the Hebrews in the Bible were and who they are in the earth today, which would be the so-called Negroes, Hispanics, the Native Americans, the Aborigines, uh, no matter what you're presented with, you still want to dispute this and maintain your superior, pompous, arrogant attitudes. Jesus was not white. He was a black man. And I know this is going to offend a lot of you racist uh, Christians out there, man, but it, it's true, man. I mean, I'm not going to lie. White people are racist, man. <laughs> seriously, seriously. I was in that boat. I mean, white people are racist, but... I'm not, I'm not sticking up for, you know, I'm not kissing butt here, but I'm just saying that Jesus was not white. He was a black man. He was a black man. Your true Jews, or your true youth, are the so-called black person, or African American, as you like to call them sometimes. This is in response to all the videos that I see about um, Jesus being black. Um, Vera 747, who claims all the kings of England were black. The black race is a uh, better evolved race, more superior, more intelligent, uh, and then history has been tricked. And of course, this is all true. This is all true. This is all true. I have fooled the whole world into the biggest sham of all time. The name and identity of the real fella has been taken over by me. <laughs> there are thousands of paintings of Jesus, and they don't even come close, which serve to replace the real fella, who probably looked more like Morgan Freeman. <laughs> but who cares? The truth doesn't matter, as long as you pay your tithes. <laughs> gotcha.